Hello, I would like to provide a few useful tips on how to support your mental well-being during coronavirus. I'm a PhD student in the School of Psychology at the University of Birmingham and I am interested in the benefits of nature exposure. The current situation is taking its toll on many people's well-being for various reasons. With more people getting infected, you may feel wor worried about loved ones or helpless over the situation. Or you might find it hard to focus on your work while being at home. Perhaps you are feeling lonely due to the limited opportunities to socialise. Spending time in nature may help you counter these effects. Scientists increasingly recognise the beneficial effects of nature exposure on immune functioning, mood and feelings of well-being. Additionally, exposure to nature reduces stress levels and helps feeling less overwhelmed and more in control of the situation. My own research in the School of Psychology shows that walking in a park can enhance the ability to focus, which might make it easier to work from home. You can benefit from nature in several ways. You might choose to spend time in your garden or use your restricted time outside to visit a park near your home. To make the most of your time in nature, try to be present. Focus on what is around you. Turn off your phone and try to smell, see and hear the unfolding of the beautiful spring. If you don't want to leave your home because you are self-isolating, you can bring nature into your home. You can buy a house plant or put flowers in a vase. In addition to bringing benefits such as cleaner air, this will allow you to experience similar effects to spending time outside. If you don't like to fill your home with plants, use essential oils to bring the smell of nature into your home. My research shows that you can experience the benefits by simply watching a video of nature, allowing you to experience nature at your convenience. And don't worry about adding something else to your to-do list. Studies suggest that merely 20 minutes a day will allow you to benefit from spending time in nature. You can easily combine this with other activities. For example, you can eat lunch outside or while watching a nature video, or you can go to a park for your daily exercise or walk along a tree-lined street when running errands. All of this should be easy to implement alongside the government's current advice. Experiencing nature in whichever way you decide is the best for you will improve your mood, help you cope with loneliness and support your well-being. Thank you for listening.